welcome to the demo video for our GlucoRx Q meter. Here we will be covering how to perform a quality control test. Our GlucoRx control solution contains a known amount of glucose that reacts with the test strips. It is used to ensure the meter and strips are working together correctly. Insert your test strip into the meter and wait for the flashing blood sample on the screen. Select your meal marker by pressing the main function button until the QC symbol appears on the screen. Then put your meter down. Shake your control solution vial thoroughly before use. Remove the cap and place it on a hard surface. Remember, your solution has a 90 day expiry once opened. Be sure to make note of the date you opened your vial. Squeeze out the first droplet onto the lid top then wipe it off. Squeeze out another drop and again place it onto the lid top. Do not perform your QC test directly from the solution vial. Hold the meter and move your test strip to touch the solution droplet. The meter will automatically begin to count down from six to zero. Your control solution result will then appear on the screen. Compare your result with the range printed on your test strip vial. Your results should fall within this range. Here are a few recommendations for when you should be control testing your meter. 1. When you first receive your meter and it is brand new out of the box. 2. When you open a brand new pot of test strips. 3. If you suspect your test strips or meter are not working properly. 4. If you think your meter is broken or damaged. 5. If your meter is presenting a reading that is not consistent with how you feel. Lastly, see below a list of possible causes for an out of range QC reading. 1. If there was an error in performing the test. 2. The control solution was shaken poorly before completing the test. 3. The QC solution was contaminated or out of date. As mentioned previously, there is a 90 day expiry once the vial has been opened. You can order a new QC vial free of charge from GlucoRx customer services. 4. The test strips have been overexposed to oxygen or out of date. Ensure you are closing your test strip pot securely after each test to preserve your strips. 5. Meter or strip malfunction. 6. Either the control solution, strips or meter are too hot or cold. All equipment should be kept at room temperature. If you continue to have test results fall outside of the range printed on the test strip vial, the meter and strips may not be working properly. Do not test your blood. Contact our customer services team for help.